Our flagships, we believe, are the best of our experiences, and so it was important that we had a location in D.C. This doesn't happen very often, where you get up to have 51,000 square feet in an urban center like this, right next to the metro, in an amazing upcoming neighborhood. It's important for us to not just come from Seattle and expect that we can deliver the REI that we know in the Northwest in a place like, say, here in D.C. Um, so we really want to understand the community, uh, understand what their needs are and expectations are for us to be joining their neighborhood. This building, uh, formerly known as Uline Arena, uh, most recently called Washington Coliseum, uh, was this great site that, that REI found. Um, so when we came in the building, you could really feel that this building had a soul to it. Um, and that's what REI likes, and um, I myself was really excited about it, of how could we um, turn this into a thriving retail experience um, while still showcasing some of that, that rich history. The history of this building is, is something else, right? Uh, thankfully, uh, in partnership with Callis and RTKL and Douglas Development, we were able to uh, really bring what was available in this space back to life. Uh, in particular, the original column supporting the barrel vault roof, um, as well as the basketball court flooring and stadium chairs. Those touch points really are kind of the best uh, of uh, giving a nod to what this place was for the community. When we talk about localization, uh, you know, there is so many touch points, particularly at the product level, that really connects uh, the merchandise with place. Not only where to buy your hiking boots, but where to go and take them. Uh, or your favorite mountain biking trail here uh, in Washington, D.C. It's pretty exciting to see that connection uh, through primarily the in-store messaging and the talents of our team bringing that to life. It's, it's really pretty beautiful stuff. Our relationship with REI is really unique in that our teams um, come together and really act as an extension of each other. We've been doing this since 2011 when we did the Soho flagship, um, but we're able to work together um, really for the last year to help them evolve what their retail experience would be and how that could address the customer needs um, really for this new era of bricks and mortar retail. Having that partnership, having this basis of design in the market concept and this idea of creating this place of discovery and these wandering paths and stitching our shops together in this amazing building has really been kind of amazing.